Jose Gregorio Hernández was a Venezuelan doctor well known for his faith. Pope Francis announced his beatification on June 19th in the midst of one of the most unstable periods in Venezuela's history. Yet one quality of the so-called doctor of the poor is his ability to unite the country. Cardinal Baltasar Porras traveled to Rome to plan for the much-anticipated event. We were just at the Congregation for Divine Worship, presenting the texts for the Mass. We asked that the liturgical feast be on October 26th, which is his birthday, rather than the date of his death, which is what is usually done. We asked this since he died on June 29th, which is the solemnity of St. Peter and St. Paul. He also recalled the scientific advances José Gregorio Hernández brought to Venezuela and how he always cared for the dignity of each person. He had a very active role during the Spanish flu outbreak more than 100 years ago, another epidemic that took many lives around the world and in Venezuela. The José Gregorio of yesterday is the José Gregorio of today, which is the one we have to not only hold in our hearts, but also put into action, as all Venezuelans must do. The Church in Venezuela has been united in supporting those most affected by the humanitarian crisis. On January 19th, Pope Francis sent this video message to the Venezuelan bishops, asking them to remember two principles to ensure the growth of the Church, love of neighbor and service to others. No se fracturen, hermanos. No se fracturen. Siempre hay una posibilidad de unirse, como siempre hay una posibilidad de aislarse y crear una actitud del corazón sectaria fuera de la unidad de la Iglesia. We know there are many different ways one can seek to divide any institution. We don't live on a cloud, we live in reality. Being in constant contact with one another and having a clear picture of our duty in mind reminds us that we are not meant to act alone or steal the spotlight from one another. In the face of the humanitarian crisis, Cardinal Porras affirms the Church in Venezuela continues to defend the dignity of the people and he hopes the beatification of José Gregorio Hernández will be a symbol of hope to a people crying out in need.